Hi everyone, this is a tutorial video on how to use the Bigley Brothers E59 Mark II drone. First, when you open the box, you will see the drone with its controller. It also comes with two batteries, set of propeller blades, and a manual. Before starting up your drone, make sure to select an open space without obstacles like high voltage lines, trees, buildings, people, or pets, and also avoid strong wind and heavy rain. Make sure that the battery is fully charged and is inserted properly. Verify that the propellers are securely attached to the drone and that the arms of the drone are extended correctly. First, ready the drone application by scanning the QR code found in the manual using any QR scanner you can download from either the App Store, Google Store, Play Store, and install. Or another way, you can search and install the RX drone application directly. Make sure that you do not open the drone app yet, or ensure that you quit the current application entirely. It is not yet the time to open it. Power up your drone by first inserting a battery, and make sure that it is completely fitted inside the insertion area for the drone to function as it is expected and to avoid possibilities of the battery to fall off during takeoff. As soon as the battery is successfully inserted, turn on your drone by pressing the power button from the side of the battery and wait for the lights to show that the drone is ready. Now, if ever you encounter a problem turning on the drone, you should check the battery again and make sure it is fitted fully inside. Place the drone horizontally on a flat surface to ground facing you. Wait for 3 seconds before turning on the controller. Press the gyro or geomagnetic calibration button for 3 seconds and wait for the beep sound. Now, pick up the drone facing you, then rotate it clockwise 3 times. After, vertically face the drone upward facing the sky and rotate it clockwise 3 times as well. Place the drone again on the ground and step 1 meter away or more from the drone. For about 1 to 4 minutes, the drone searches for GPS signals. Once the beep sound is heard, wait until the controller shows GPS stars of more than 8 before unlocking the drone. Now turn your data off, then turn your Wi-Fi on and use it to link your phone to the drone. Go to Settings, turn your Wi-Fi on, then locate the drone's name in the networks listed below. But some of you might ask, how would I know which one to select? To help you, the correct name is commonly preceded with the HR underscore GPS. But if you're really having a problem finding the name, how about you try re-enabling your Wi-Fi, then search for the name again. After successfully connecting your phone to the drone, it is now time to open your RX drone application. Check the I have read in detail and agree box and click allow all access permissions. Press play and wait for an image to display from the drone's camera. But in some cases that the image does not display for you, Please press the back button and press the play button again or close the app fully and reopen it and press start. 
When an image from the drone's camera finally appears, your drone application is now ready. Again, when the controller shows a GPS stars of more than 8, you can now long press the unlock button or manually unlock the drone by moving left throttle stick downward left and right throttle stick downward right both at the same time until the propellers activate. Now your drone is ready for takeoff. Remember that it is highly recommended to rise your drone at the safe height, which is not less than 5 meters. And make sure to please take out the drone's batteries when keeping and no longer in use.